And welcome back. This is Weller Scuba with another StarCraft 2 commentary. I am going to be doing this live. I try to get three for you guys whenever I try to do this. I do find an opponent. This is pretty quick for me these days. Um, I'm going to be going up against Modus Ponens, a Zerg player, S on Slag Pits. So hopefully we're not uh, across, you know, kind of diagonally here. Uh, you guys know what I mean, right? You know, I hope he's not up here um, because I tend to freak out when they're that close and I just start to go, okay, let's go now. Ugh. I assume that Modus is the name of his clan and then his real name is Ponens, which is not that great of a name, I'll be honest with you. I don't like it. It's typical, but not, I don't know. It's not like the awesome sauce that is my name, Baller Scuba. Actually, I, I think I told you guys that I've had that name since forever. Um, since most of you were in diapers. Nah, I've been on this forum lately and it makes me feel old. People talking about the best game ever and it's only games that have been around for uh, five years. And I'm kind of like, yeah, I kind of like that game, except uh, I like older games. You know, <laughs> games with stories, that kind of stuff. There we go, getting the first barracks up. You guys saw it was a Zerg player, right? That is important. That is stuff you guys need to be paying attention to. And no, he's not there. Go over there. So, yeah, oh, there he is, I think I found him. Uh, he might be down here, actually. Let's go down here instead. Hopefully I'm not wrong about that. Uh, it just always seems to me that he would have been there a little bit sooner had he had, if this was his first choice. I'm just saying. Come on, there we go. Rain out. Come on, hunches. Job, no, damn you, Hunch. Roger. So, that is a late oh, scout. Um, yeah, there's not much else to say about that. Upgrade complete. Oh, dick. <laughs> there's really no other way to put that. Dick. And spawning pool. Didn't see an expansion. Spawning pool is actually almost done. Um, no, keep attacking. Don't stop attacking. Let's get the second and third barracks up over there. Away from them. Yeah, whatever. FCB ready. Add on complete. You go back there. Oh, we got a decent Zerg player for once. Oh my gosh. Oh, get out of there, get out of there! No! Okay, so he did go for the expansion eventually. Uh, just took a sweet ass time getting it. Um, bunker, please. Okay, three racks up, bunker in play. This better be good. That's fine. Not a full block off, as you can clearly see there. Um, that's not really the important thing right now. Um, it's that he would need a shit ton to get past that. And that's the important part. So, you know, the basic question here is, is he willing to lose all of those Zerglings to try to get a little bit of harassment done? The answer should be no, uh, but you never know. You saw that expansion, um, so I'm thinking that I need to go for some kind of early aggressive build here. Uh, of course, whenever I'm up against a Zerg player, I like to go aggressive. 
simply because they tend to expand really quickly, and that is not good for me. Uh, was that a Tesla going down this? And he just died, didn't he? Um, ah, oh, crap, no. I was wondering, I'm like, why am I so high on gas? That's why. Freaking dumbass. Forgot to get crap. Crap is good. Get crap when you can. Sorry, I don't feel like I've been very entertaining today. Um, like I said, I go in threes, so uh, the last two ones, you know, I kind of feel like we're okay. Um, they're not really up to par, but, um, you know, as far as I know, you guys still like the uh, live broadcast videos a little bit better than the full analysis. If you guys actually like the full Research. analysis better, you know, let me know that. Um, you know, I do this for you guys. Um, yeah, I'm going to do what I want from time to time. And roaches. And a spine crawler. So he's going defensive here, uh, which makes me want uh, to not go, uh, you know, aggressive. But I want to expand. That is what it makes me want to do. Are you guys with me on that? Expansions for the win. For the keep me in the game, not necessarily a win. Um, I might actually have enough. Um, that, that wasn't very many, you know? So I'm gonna expand here. Ah, fuck. Alright, he saw my army, that's not a good sign. Um, let's put two marines there. He went roaches, which is what I like to see. Because that means he didn't go for Baylor. And it looks like I'm going to have enough to crush this army. Yes! Yeah, he's still there. Okay. Nothing too bad there. On supply lock until the push comes. What? Don't complain about your bad game, man. Whatever. Okay, whatever. Uh, so yeah, I clearly won that. <laughs> uh, the talkers are always diamond. Are you a diamond player? Called it Talkers or Diamond. Uh, ranked number 11th in his... Number 11th. What am I doing today? Ranked 11th in his Diamond Division. 2,945 points. 272 wins. 261 losses. So there we go. A, uh, what should have been a long match on Slag Pits. I was going for the expansion. Trying to get some, some work done. He complained that he was supply locked. That's not my fault, dude. Good game, though. Um, did he say good game? I think he did. You guys have to go back and check for me. Uh, yeah, that was that was interesting. Um, scanning, you know, scanning does help. That's something that I don't do very often. But when I did scan there, I saw the roaches. Saw he was going defensive. Saw he went for the spine crawlers. Uh, what it does mean that is that he either did not go for banelings, or if he did have banelings, it wasn't going to be very many. So I felt comfortable making a push, uh, you know, at, at the very least, um, getting in there, seeing that his army was a little bit larger than mine, and running away. I don't do that very often, but that is the least that you can do, secure that expansion, get all that work done. Uh, you know, you don't want to let Zerd players go on, you know unchecked for too long uh so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the game i hope you laughed hope you learned let me know what you feel about these live games because 
really, I, I've only gotten comments on the first one and said that you guys liked it. Or, you know, do you still like it? Do you want uh, more analysis games? Uh, do you want me to be a little more selective with my live games? Because it is pretty tough to be selective. Um, it's kind of hard to tell how a game's going to be before I start broadcasting it. So if I spend, you know, a couple hours trying to get live broadcasting done, then I want to get, you know, a few games in. Uh, I'll be trying to go for another one after this. If it doesn't work out, well, you'll know it was a bad game. Uh, what did I say? Hope you enjoyed the game. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.